Good afternoon, traders. It is Friday, January 6, 2016. The U.S. stock market is closed. Hey, I'm trying to get this done right away. I just want it out of the way, and I don't want to think about uh, the stock market anymore this weekend. This was just really frustrating today. It isn't that we did any worse than I expected. We had... Um, negative almost six thousand dollars in open trade yesterday with that crappy trade into gauze and we closed everything out and the crappy trade stayed crappy and we ended up closing out um a little over six thousand dollars in close out trades negative uh, this morning so that was what was expected uh, I was irritated by the fact that we only got into one position today, and that uh, was inverse gold mining dust. And that went the wrong direction, and we're holding negative $2,000 in open trade. So, you know, it, it, it was a crappy day, but that isn't terrible at all. I mean, we experience those kinds of losses all the time but what's got me in a bad mood is the Dow Jones Industrial Average which of course we don't trade but I watch it as a barometer of what's going on and what's going on really gets you pulling out its hair we've been talking about taking out 20,000 it seems for a long time now and this thing goes up and it gets within 20 points, 20,000, and then it backs off. And it's done that, I think, about six times so far. I, it, there's a psychological barrier there. Uh, and if you don't think there's a psychological barrier, what happened today is, uh, I think stocks actually hold, open negative. But they put in an early bull spike here, and then took off and I thought they might be going for it here while well, they were going for it let me tell you what happened the high of today in the Dow Jones industrial average was 19,999.63 yeah folks that means it got less than a half a point from 20,000 and then it backs off. Closing down, I think, about 40 points from there now. Um, so if you don't think, you know, there's no technical reason for this. It's all psychological. And um, there are crazy traders out there and they're using this, uh, believing that uh, it, it can't go, it can't, go higher than 20,000 so that's a great place to go short or a great place to take profits and that's what's happening but it's strictly a psychological thing but a psychological thing can just drive you crazy and it's driving us crazy because any buying we do it just can't go higher and um, so it's just really it's a, it's, it's a hair shirt. It's more irritating than really damaging. But anyway, I am not happy. have absolutely nothing to show. I, as far as what my call is, I'm calling it down. This, this, this thing has either got to go down or it's got to break through that. If it broke through it on Monday, I think it would really scream. But I think it has to take a run at it from a lower point, and I thought that that's what I was doing here today. Didn't happen, as I say, got within less than a half a point of 20,000, backs off. Oh, anyway, I got it over with. I'm not going to show you any more stocks. I don't have anything decent to show you. Trader Bob's not, on, not happy, but you guys have a great weekend anyway. I'm going to have a great weekend by not thinking about the stock market. See you on Monday.